that init. And this Veeam object init is trying to call its superclass init. And that is expecting a path string. I think the problem How do you print a parent class? I think because it's multiple inheriting, it's like bases. It's um trying to read the method from a different class. Here it says the super class is OpenGL Math Tech. Does OpenGL Math Tech require a path string? It doesn't. I mean, let's just print super. Print super function. Shouldn't this actually... I'm not just supposed to call this like... Oh, I think you don't have to put the self here. Never mind. What is this inheriting from? Oh, this is inheriting from regular mobject now. Which actually still doesn't make sense. Because a regular object doesn't require a path string either. What is the error? And it is missing a required positional argument path string. Maybe I just have to step into that if it's possible. Ooh, then it's using... Is OpenGL Veeam object still a thing? I knew this was going to make it difficult. Yeah, OpenGL Veeam object is still a thing. But not OpenGL object. So... You can write a delegate method from the superclass you want to print. I think I figured it out now. Um, but I think I don't know how to fix it. Where am I even? So OpenGL vectorized object called the superclass in it. Which brought it to, wait, SVG mobject? Wait, I think this makes sense, actually. If I diff the SVG mobjects between SVG mobject, meta mobject SVG. And I go to this one. I print SVG mobject. I can't believe those are the same. That doesn't make too much sense to me. SVG mobject dot I here. Oh, it shouldn't even be calling this, right? This SVG magic. Don't I have an OpenGL? I do have an OpenGL SVG magic. So the fact that it was even called here is an error. So. I have to go to OpenGL vectorized object. Here. No, I wasn't trying to do that. This is some error in the, in the, um, 
fucking... Just kidding, I don't swear. Inheritance chain. Fucking... Just kidding, I don't swear. Inheritance a chain. So step into this. Why is this an SVG object? Self self dot class class dot bases at zero dot bases again at zero dot How did this ever end up in SVG object, a regular SVG object? When it has OpenGL as SVG object in its inheritance chain. Hmm. Do I not know Python? I'll try to step through this one more time. Oh, it's already done something I don't understand. Because it goes into SVG object there. From OpenGL vectorized object. Maybe the fact that... Mm, this object is messing stuff up, I know it. I'm starting from here. I'm calling the init init for the super class. What does super do? Maybe super is doing something other than I think it's doing. I think what this is supposed to be doing is like a object in it, right? And then the super class might have... I'm gonna see what super does. Same as super underscore underscore class first argument oh that help is not helpful at all stop same as super underscore underscore class if I look at underscore underscore class That's an OpenGL Vim object. So I don't see why it doesn't call regular object anyway. I don't know. I'll see if I'll see if this works. I use the self, that's true. Perfect. Debugging is not fun. I hate to break it to us. I don't know if we can merge the mobject and OpenGL mobject that easily. Because I have no idea why that would happen. But if I um if I do the same thing on man on three then it does work. And I I'm not sure the benefit of merging the two classes 
is worth figuring out how the text rendering works a second time. Mm. Mm. No, it wasn't tested. Yeah, this pretty much makes the entire the entire PR probably won't work. Well, let me see. I have the text here. And that's broken. Paragraph here. Um, I think I can actually... Yeah, do this for the markup text. That's broken. Paragraph. Um, here, the paragraph. Is also broken. Well, it seems like the same bug at least. But I don't know how debuggable this will be, really. Because I'll be having to, I'll have to um I'll have to trace a logic path that didn't exist prior to the two classes being merged. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead into the bug or into the PI where they were merged and say that was likely premature. So like combine something. This PR deleted so much. I guess it replaced self dot data points with self dot points as well. So it's just deleted. Oh wait, this file is still here, I guess. Wait, how is the file still there when I can't find it? Oh, it's only OpenGL point. Okay, so that's all deleted. And what's in OpenGL or in the object? I guess just mostly pasted the stuff there. Uh, there's actually a f self dot data at points. Yeah, I don't know if we can just if we can just merge it like this. This broke too much stuff. Mm. Okay. I don't know what to say, guys. Is TR Roboto in here? He isn't right now. Mm. Everyone in the everyone in the Discord and stuff is gonna hate me because I, I revert things kind of a lot. Um this and my browser froze i tried to zoom in like twice and it just froze 
this change breaks a lot of my work in on porting block type and text to OpenGL and um, the errors it caused aren't And um, the errors it caused aren't well to debug since the inheritance chains were modified. Um, I'll say do. Due to interweaving revert this until our um, working. Well, I hate to have to do that, but um, I think that's the only way we're going to bring it, be able to bring text over. Well, anyway, yeah, it's really unfortunate. I mean, I never, from the beginning, I didn't think this would work. I actually didn't think it would even be possible without a lot of work to merge the two. But since it's creating new code paths that don't exist upstream or in the community version, that's just a lot of debugging. So I don't know if that if that would be worth it. Okay. Well, I did manage to get text and LaTeX working. I usually go for two hours, but now I'm in this awkward place where there's only a little bit of time, and I don't know what I'd start next. It's also good that I saved this in another... another repo. Because otherwise... I don't know where I'd have to jump back to. I guess here or something. Yeah, I guess here. Um, maybe I could start a new tweet, but I don't even know what to tweet about right now. I did the lenses. We got some sen offensive content there. That's good. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna end it here, since I I finished the one thing I was trying to do, and um, I'm not totally sure what to do next. For a compromise of the inheritance thing, why not release the merged object? Release with the merged object and OpenGL object, then revert it. I don't know if the operations are that independent because um, the text objects are working from the code as it was before it was merged. And so it's, it's not necessarily true that it, I can have this work, commit it after the merge is done of the two object classes and then revert that. Release 050 with the merge stuff. Well, merging the objects doesn't actually provide any benefit to the end user. So, um, it doesn't provide any benefit to the end user, and 
it's actually causing a net negative to us, the developers, because it makes porting OpenGL stuff harder. Although, I think after porting the text, I don't think there's anything else to port. I do think it does, though. In what way? But you're in the Discord, right? So we can talk there. Or you can get in a VC and we can do it, like, on the stream if you are okay with that. Being able to use both renders without rewriting code. So the code duplication doesn't... The code duplication will, like, generally is a good thing. Since it, you know, prevents you from having to fix the same bug multiple times. But in this case, we needed that duplication because we have two different versions of the same object. One from... And they're, like, years apart, actually. So it isn't clear that those were even... Um, designed to ever be merged. But we can talk about it some more in the Discord. I'm sure there'll be plenty of people mad at me. But, okay. I'm going to end it here. And I'll see you in the next one or in Discord.